everybody, welcome to Children's Church. Today, today is Sunday, July 19th, and this is the last Sunday in our series on feelings. And today I'm going to read a book to you, and it is about um, the feeling of self-esteem. It's called, I'm going to like me, letting off a little self-esteem. So I am going to read it right now. I'm going to like me when I jump out of bed from my giant big toe to the braids on my head. I'm going to like me when I grin and see the space in my mouth where two teeth used to be. I'm going to like me wearing flowers and plaid. I have my own style. I don't follow some fad. I'm going to like me when I climb on and wave as the bus pulls away and I'm feeling so brave. I'm going to like me when I'm called on to stand. I know all my letters like the back of my hand. I'm going to like me when my answer is wrong, like thinking my ruler was 10 inches long. I'm going to like me when I'm sharing my lunch, because just like bananas, friends come in a bunch. I'm going to like me when I jump up so high, I'll twist and I'll stretch straight up to the sky. I'm going to like me when I fall and get hurt and mess up my elbows in pebbles and dirt. I'm going to like me when I don't run so fast then they pick when they pick teams and I'm chosen last. I'm going to like me when I do the right thing and return what I found even when it's I'm going to like me when I'm feeling strong. I'll walk with a smile, arms swinging, legs long. I'm going to like me when I sit with my mom and make a get well card for my sick friend Tom. I'm going to like me when I eat something new, even if grandma makes octopus stew. I'm going to like me when I make a mistake and put out the candles on Dad's birthday cake. I'm going to like me when I open the box and smile and say thanks, even though I got socks. I'm going to like me when I try a new task. I bring in a plate before I am asked. I'm going to like me when I clean in a flesh and play with my brother and take out the trash. I'm going to like me when I cuddle up tight and know as I'm sleeping I'm safe and all right. I'm going to like me because I'm loved and I know it and liking myself is the best way to show it. I'm going to like me. I already do. But enough about me. How about you? The end. Hi, I hope you enjoyed our story. One of the things I wanted to talk a little bit about is how special each one of you are. Um, and look, I have a special friend with me right now. This is my cat, Maddie. And she is a very unique and beautiful animal. And God made you, God made her, God made me, each of us unique and special. There's no one like you in the whole world. And I thought it would be fun because snowflakes are unique too. And so I thought it'd be fun if we make a snowflake that is not going to be like anybody else's snowflake to help us remind ourselves that we are special and that God made us wonderfully. So what you do is you get a piece of plain paper like that. You fold it in half. 
Then you fold it in half again. And if you want a really fancy one, you fold it in half one more time. And if you want it super fancy, you fold it in half one more time. And then you take a pair of scissors and you cut little pieces out of it. You don't want to cut all the way through, but you want to cut little, maybe a little notch like that in one side, or you could cut another notch on the other side. Maybe you want to have a different shape. So you might do like a, a circle or like a U. Doesn't matter, you can make it any way you want. And no matter what you decide to do, your snowflake is gonna be like no one else's. All right, you ready to see what it looks like? So I'm gonna unfold it. And all the pieces that I cut out make a wonderful design. Isn't that fun? So you can make a whole series of snowflakes and each one will be different, just like you. So let's thank, let's say a word of thanks to God for all the good things that God has given us. Gracious God, we thank you so much that you made each one of us special, and you made each one of us unique, and you give, have gifted us with all kinds of wonderful gifts and talents. We pray that you will help us use them and that you will bless us this day. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Thank you all very much for joining me at Children's Church. I'll see you next time. Bye.